Detective Logan. Hello, Jaden. What's the situation? It's bad, sir. Archie's grave has been desecrated. There's no damage, though. They just took the body. Uh, I was hoping we'd forget about Archie already. What would anyone want with his body? I don't know, sir. This investigation is wearing me out. I could use some rest. But I didn't come empty-handed, sir. Jaden, why do you always leave the important things for last? Sorry, sir. All right, what have you got? I was going through the records of the people connected to Archie Thompson and discovered a most interesting fact. Archie was the illegitimate son of Matilda Graham Taylor. Go on. I didn't want to let you down again, so I acted as fast as I could. I took out a search warrant and went to her mansion with a couple of constables. There was no one there. Even the servants were gone. We searched the house and it looked as if they left in a hurry. That was strange enough, but what we found in the house was the real shocker. Let's hear it, Jaden. I found Matilda's memoirs and looked through them. It turns out that she had been Archie's accomplice all along. She had a hand in almost everything that happened. What? Damn it, we have to arrest her immediately. If Archie was her son, she should be furious about his death. There's no telling what she could do now. Yes, sir. I put a bulletin out for her arrest, but she's still at large. Hmm. I seem to remember there's an estate in Scotland that belongs to Matilda's family. It's a long shot, but we should go there and investigate. And we can't afford to wait for another warrant. We leave right now. No police detail. Just the two of us. Right now, sir? Yes. No time to waste. Here we are, Jaden. This is awfully quiet, even for a mountain town at night. Detective, the bridge is damaged here. We might try to cut this tree down and use it as a makeshift bridge. But we'll need a saw. If that's what it takes. Something bad is brewing here. I can feel it. A brewery, sir? I wouldn't mind going for a pint myself. Jaden, what's the matter with you? We're not here for beers. Pull yourself together, man. Yes, sir. Jaden, when are you going to stop goofing around and start paying attention? Sorry, sir. Wait here while I look for a sword. Jar. What in the world happened here? I have a really bad feeling about this. Jaden, there is some rotten business going on here. I found a jar filled with a muddy fluid in that house, and there was a human hand inside it. A uh, hand, sir? Do you think it was real? It seemed real to me. Everything about Archie Thompson means death. I don't think I need to see it. Easy does it! Oh, great! We can get across now. Just be careful, please. Thank you, Detective. You too, sir. I'll do my best. If you'll pardon my question, sir, thinking about all those times I've let you down, why haven't you fired me yet? Oh, you'll be surprised, Jaden, but I used to be a clumsy greenhorn just like you when I was starting out. I keep you around because I see myself in you. You mean one day I could become a great detective just like you, sir? That's up to you, and I'm not great. I'll do my best, sir. Now is a good time to start. We have to get going. Yes, sir.
There's no one here. It's like everyone vanished. Do you think this one had a body in it too, sir? It might have. I hope I'm wrong. Why is she doing this? We need to get to the bottom of this. The mansion is close by. Matilda might still be there. Detective, I'll be waiting by the front door. Very well. I'll be right there. I expected that much. Wait here while I look for a key. Yes, sir. I'll be here guarding the door. I'm sure you can manage that.
Great, I've got the key. Let's hurry up and go inside. Yes, sir. Detective, this is... this is... I know, Jaden. But that's... Calm down, Jaden. Let's check that room to the left. Yes, sir. <coughs> Damn it. All right, forget it, Jaden. It was just a stray dog. I was just... And then all of a sudden... looks recent. I think the body has been chemically processed. Could this be Archie? Oh, I don't know, sir. All right, enough of the guesswork. What else do we have here? Matilda is probably gone, but we can at least look around for some clues. This is a strange helmet. It's locked with a key, as if there's something important inside. Another lock, another key. Stay here, Jaden. I'll be right back. Yes, sir.
This is horrible. What insane people would do something like this?
What a strange mask. Wait a minute. I saw an opening shaped just like this mask near the entrance to the cave. We should go there. Yes, sir. I'll be there waiting for you. Absolutely right, sir. It's shaped just like the mask we found. Jaden, this is serious. We're going in, and there's no telling who or what we're going to find in there. I'm ready. Jaden! Oh, I'm, I'm all right, sir. Just twisted an ankle. Doesn't look like they want any visitors. Hang in there. I'll try to get that grate opened. There's a strange mechanism here that came up as soon as I put the mask in. Maybe it unlocks the grate. All right, sir. Thank you, sir. We're going in, Jaden. Keep your eyes open. Yes, sir. It's too dark in here. Let me brighten it up for you. What in the world? What in the world? Is that all you can say? I always thought you were a primitive creature, Logan. Look at so beautiful, my son, my handsome, talented Archie. His beauty is now forever. There will be no more pain, my boy. You are under arrest, Matilda, and believe me, you will face the full brunt of the law. Jaden, put her in handcuffs. Yes, sir. It makes no difference to me now. My son will live on. My love for him is all that matters. I had to endure so much. All these jokers don't deserve to stand beside him, but without them, I couldn't have given my Archie his immortality. How ironic, don't you think? You couldn't have done all of this by yourself. You must have had help. Where are the townspeople? Look around. They are all here. You do realize, detective, that I have created a new kind of art. And there will be others to follow in my footsteps. That I can promise you. You are a monster, Matilda. It's too bad I cannot judge you myself. <laughs>